For thousands of Ohio companies, business is booming in the Buckeye State, and the world wants more. Ohio's businesses are competitive internationally. A lot of people don't understand that. We are. The opportunity right now for us is huge. Um, I think that if you don't decide to go uh, overseas, then you're missing out on an opportunity. For the first time ever, annual exports from Ohio have topped $52 billion. That's up a staggering 37% in the last decade alone. In fact, 95% of the world's population and 70% of the world's purchasing power is outside of the United States. This state helped me overcome a lot of obstacles that would have been very challenging alone, and it's really awesome knowing that there's a team of people that I am able to contact and ask questions to, and they're just very helpful. You might assume that most exports from Ohio come from large companies with multi-million dollar deals. Truth is, more than 90% of exporters are small businesses with less than 500 employees. Some even come from home-based companies like Becky Crumbs. Let me go show you where we package and ship the original block. Becky's product is a vinyl covered foam block that acts as a building block for gymnastics. Kids all over the world learn basic handstands with this product, each handcrafted and uniquely Ohio. We have somebody make the tops in town, so they put the screen printing on them in, the in town and then I bring them back to where they're sewn and it's an Amish family that sews the blocks for us. Everything ships from my living room. Nearly 17,000 companies are now selling Ohio products internationally. Nick Engler is selling a piece of Ohio history. From Dayton, Nick builds and sells flight simulators, so anyone, anywhere in the world, can get a sense for what it was like when Ohio's Wright brothers first took to the skies. They liked the idea of having these planes built in the same, um, the same city where the Wright brothers once worked, and uh, that's, a, that's a big deal for them. All of this has opened up simply because of exports. It was the state trade office that helped Nick navigate the intricacies of doing business overseas. It can be intimidating, as Robert Pergert knows. Before his company could help factories and plants run more efficiently worldwide, he started by asking for guidance from his home state. And that's what's so advantageous for Ohio, is that if small businesses know that the resource is there, we have something that's unique compared to many other states that will help them overcome those kinds of concerns and fears makes their job a lot easier, believe me, rather than have to learn all of this on their own. You know, these types of programs are invaluable to smaller companies with limited resources that are really trying to grow their companies. Kyvac is a commercial cleaning equipment manufacturer. We have a couple niche products that specialize in washroom hygiene and food service and uh, also some floor care systems as well. And when Kyvac was ready to expand, they turned to the state of Ohio and within months had established business channels in Europe. As a small company, obviously we have limited resources. So what the state of Ohio has done for us is bring some of their knowledge and expertise to the table uh, that we can obviously benefit from. That's especially true when dealing in regions that don't speak English. The state of Ohio has representatives in 35 countries dedicated to developing opportunities. Dublin-based Sutphin has sold their state-of-the-art fire trucks on three continents and are pursuing a fourth, knowing that what we make here is in demand everywhere. You know, the world's shrinking, everything's global. And if you're only, if you're only competing at a, at, a, at, a, at a market that's no further than our borders, you're probably not going to survive in the future. The place to start is to contact the state of Ohio's export office. Hey, our experience with them has been second to none. I will tell you is that I've worked with economic development folks in other countries, but the Ohio Trade Office in India is the, the premier one in the world. Uh, the ease of being able to do business overseas in Europe, uh, I think, is, is never, has never been better. So it gives us the opportunity to obviously uh, bring new people on board to continue to support our growth, uh, and that means more jobs in Ohio. I think opportunities are endless and to have the proper people in place to help you do that is very important. 